Hey everybody, Propway1 here, and I went to Spirit today, and I bought these two, which are my two favorite props of the year. Looming Straw Man and Pumpkin Patch Prowler. I really like these two props almost about equally. Straw Man is my favorite this year, though, and Pumpkin Patch Prowler is number two. And yes, yeah, surprisingly, since Straw Man is my favorite prop... He's actually going to wait till tomorrow to be unboxed. I don't know when the video is going to go up, though. And I'm actually going to open Prowler first. I don't know why. I'm just kind of more anxious to see the Prowler um, instead of Straw Man. Like, I kind of know what Straw Man's going to do, but I've never seen Prowler in person. People are saying he's small, and I still have yet to see him in person. So I'm going to be opening Prowler today. So here's Pumpkin Patch Prowler's pretty small box. Pumpkin Patch Prowler. He lurks around the pumpkin patch waiting for his next victim. When you're walking through the maze, beware of his LED eyes and glowing fingertips. His untamed laughter and twitching movements could send you hiding for your life. On off, IR sensor, step pad, or try me button activated. Multi-prop remote compatible. Step pad, try me button, multi-prop activators sold separately. Here's the side of the box. Back of the box with a poem which you can pause and read. And the diagram, which you can step pad, try me, remote compatible, comes with volume control, comes with the adapter, and the speaker uh, jack is included. Other side is the exact same thing. So without further ado, let's unbox Pumpkin Patch Prowler. Okay, so opening up his small box. That is what he looks like when you first open him. This is really cool. Okay, so here is his hand. Here's one arm with a blue harness. Shoulder support. Wow, this is a really big sh uh, shoulder support. Wow. Uh, arm. His other arm that lights up. Um... Here, his clothes, creepy cloth, and sensors in here. With all of his clothes. Um, story is down here with his instructions. So there's story. I'll give you guys a better view of that later. And here are his instructions. So here's his adapter. I like seasonal visions props because they're really not like zip tied in, so they're actually pretty easy to unbox. But there's his adapter. Head is really lightweight, which is surprising, but there's his amazing looking head. That's cool. So here is the... Oops. Here's the module that makes him move. And here is the uh, module that makes the noise and stuff and where everything like plugs in. So then removing this piece of cardboard, we can see his hip ring is right here. And finally, support poles. And his base. So that's everything Pumpkin Patch Prowler comes with. So here's every with everything that Pumpkin Patch Prowler comes with. Base, poles. Module number one, hips, shoulders, arms, adapter, instructions, story, really cool head, twitching module, creepy cloth, sensor, his coat and stuff, and his two leg pieces. Here's a good view of his story in case you're curious. And here's a really cool glimpse at his head. So with updates on the way of his setup, let's start setting up Pumpkin Patch Prowler. So here is update number one of his setup. Just like any other normal S Seasonal Visions prop, very good quality and a very easy setup. Just lay the base down, snap in the four poles, attach the twitching module, and before you do the twitching module, add his two little leg pieces. That's all I did so far and it took me about a minute and a half, I'd say. Very, 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 very easy setup. So now, you'll see update number two. So here's update number two. 
I just attached a speaker and put on his shoulders, put on his shirt and Velcroed in the sensor. And got his adapter too. So I mean that's literally all you need to see for this update. He's not quite complete. Hands, this will be my last update. Next time you see him, he will be fully complete. So ready? You're about to see him fully complete. So here is the finished Pumpkin Patch Prowler. The hardest part of the set was honestly the creepy cloth. I thought it was going to be all like separate strands, but it was all one big thing of creepy cloth. At first it was kind of hard like uh, swinging it around him, but it became pretty easy in the end. So yep, here he is all finished. I'm going to go test him off camera and come back to you with a demo and then this unboxing is over. So yes, he works. I had a heart attack at first because I forgot to plug in his twitching. So I plugged him and activated him. He wasn't twitching. So then I was like freaking out. I went inside and I forgot there was a wire dangling from his twitching. I was like, oh yeah, I forgot with twitching corpse you had to connect that. So he fully works. I love him. Definitely my second favorite. First time I've actually seen him in real life is here. But he is absolutely amazing. Highly recommend him. Go out and buy him at your store. Now, it's demo time. So here, here is his demo. Stay tuned for a full in-depth Raven review on this guy coming very soon. And also stay tuned for the Looming Straw Man unboxing, which should be coming very, 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 very soon. And this one's review might be held off for a little while, but still stay tuned for it because I plan on making it, you know, I plan on making it at some point. Thank you guys so much for watching this probably long unboxing. I hope you enjoyed and stay tuned for more videos coming very soon. Thank you and goodbye.